Ministry of Economic Growth and Job Creation was designed to facilitate and stimulate the key growth sectors in the economy. Macroeconomic growth must be supported by impactful positive changes in the lives of Jamaicans through the provision of quality jobs, access to affordable housing, clean water, and a healthy environment. Indeed, the sustainable development of industry must be partnered with strong social programs that empower Jamaicans to build a business in a reliable and sustainable economy. The modernizing and expansion of operations at the Kingston Container Terminal and the Kingston Wharf are part of a clearly defined intention to make the Port of Kingston the leading port in the region and the foremost location for logistics and near port services. Dredging and redevelopment of Gordon Key to receive the largest cargo ships is part of the determination to establish a world-class port and critical logistics center in the Western Hemisphere. Strong, decisive leadership sees plans well on the way to develop the Montego Bay port into the island's finest multi-use terminal. The expansion of the ports of Falmouth, Ocherius, Port Royal, and Port Antonio are being pursued to ensure that Jamaica remains the Caribbean's leading cruise destination. The Port Authority of Jamaica, as owners of the Montego Bay Freeport, is emerging as the leader in the development of business process outsourcing and has moved to the forefront of our sustainable growth and job creation agenda. Water is indeed life. Access to this natural resource is a human right. The development of new water systems and the refurbishing of existing channels in urban and rural areas form part of the government's commitment to improve the quality of life of all Jamaicans. We are working to increase supply while reducing the revenue water loss to ensure drought resilience through the replacement of outdated pipelines and pump houses. Major investment will take place in the sewer collector system to ensure that Jamaica's development will take place in a sustainable environment. The water sector is an important example of how the use of public funds and private capital can be combined to bring an important utility into the 21st century. Through the Housing Agency of Jamaica and the National Housing Trust, we are committed to achieving 10,000 housing stars by year 2019. The sector has a very active public-private partnership policy, which will see a higher rate of private housing investment as the government makes the required changes to the functioning of the housing trust. The concept of a high-quality island-wide highway with an efficient interlocking road network was first proposed in 1964. It is the intention of this government to bring this concept to reality. We know that transportation forms a fundamental pillar for sustainable growth. This is why the government is committed to a strong structural investment program over the next 10 years, which will give Jamaica a modern, efficient transport infrastructure. As we work to make Jamaica the place of choice to live, work, raise families and do business, this administration is committed the sustainable development of our people. The work is great and the road is long, but our goal is in sight to achieve economic development and prosperity of our nation. <music>